me an email, ben at ksco.com, and make sure you put on there Maureen uh, from Virginia, um, and put your phone number on there. I'll get back to you. Okay, Maureen? Thank you so much, Ben. God bless you. Thanks so much. I hope, I, I hope I'm clearing this up for you guys because it really is simple. It's not complicated. And, yes, we're, it seems like we're dying on the vine. It seems like our degenerative diseases and our degenerative crises are, are reaching epic and epidemic proportions, and they probably are, but it's so unnecessary, you guys. We can do this. We have to just zoom in, use our, our magnification vision, understand the logic of the body, the logic of cells and stuff, the logic of the defensive response, the logic of toxification and, de- and lack of oxygen and lack of nutrition, the logic of the extracellular matrix or the matrix or the bread, whatever you want to call it, and the electrical conductivity that's going through it. It has nothing to do with drugs. It has zero to do with the medical model. It has zero to do with your doctor. It's all in our control. Oh, we can do it all ourselves. You don't need me even. All I'm doing is coaching you through this thing. All right, I hope I'm clearing things up for you and not making it uh, more confusing. Uh, and uh, we'll continue taking some phone calls. Maybe it'll clarify it even further for you guys. Mary in Michigan, welcome to the Bright Side. What's up? Hi, Ben. Uh, uh, a couple of really quick questions here. Sure. Uh, you just gave your email address, and I didn't understand. It's Ben at... K as in King, S as in Sam, C as in Cat, O as in Oscar, KSEO. Okay. That's, that's my home Thank radio you. station. Yeah, and um, i got to tell you guys, just everybody out there listening, because every time I give my email, I get tons of emails. I get so many emails, and I try to get back to as many as I can. If I haven't gotten back to you, put second time, second attempt, third attempt, fourth attempt, whatever it is, and I'll put you know, eventually, <laughs> I hope eventually I'll get to you. But I, I literally, okay. I get hundreds of emails a month, and it's very difficult to, to reach everybody. But I want to reach everybody, so, so keep trying. Okay. Have you done anything on your blog for co- the, the cholesterol hoax? You it's gave terrible. such an awesome description of that, and I, I can never remember. I don't know if I have. To, you know, I've been writing the blog for a couple of years, and I've got hundreds of articles, and I don't remember. Sometimes I repeat myself, and I write them over and over again. Here's the scoop on cholesterol. You need it. It's not bad. It's good, and that includes right. LDL. LDL, by the way, is a carrier of cholesterol. It carries right. cholesterol to tissues. To suppress LDL is just as stupid a strategy as using any right. other prescription drug to help your body. I didn't mean to digress there. How can I help you today, Mary? Okay. Um, uh, if I'm drinking, I'm, I found out that the water that I'm drinking, it's an artesian well water, but it is acidic. And okay. um, if I'm putting stuff in it to bring up the alkalinity of it, uh, ETT. if I Use drink your that, pardon? Well, it doesn't really matter if you're drinking acidic water. Your, your stomach is acidic, so when the water gets into your stomach, it's going to become acidic anyway. So acid and, and alkaline foods are really very overrated. It's kind of much ado about nothing, and that includes acid and alkaline drinks. Now, if you're uh, drinking a mineral-rich drink, however, the fact that it's alkaline isn't as important as the fact that there's minerals in there. So by right. mineralizing your water and then using the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, by the way, is a great way to do that, you'll be raising the pH of the water. You'll be alkalinizing the water. But what really matters is you'll get the minerals in the water. And that's why lemon juice and apple cider vinegar, even though they're acidic, when you drink them, by the time they get processed, they become mineral. They, they release their minerals, and in essence, they're actually alkaline line after they've been processed. So don't pay too much attention to the acidity or the alkalinity of the water as much as you're paying attention to the mineral content of the water. And if you're uh, drinking your Beyond Tangy Tangerine or you're using liquid supplements, you're going to get good absorbable minerals. Is that, oh, is that, okay. is, is that where uh, you're going with this? Well, they, if, I'm, if I'm using magnesium to get my, my system more less acidic, which I'm mm-hmm. very acidic, mm-hmm. um, my concern was drinking that after I had eaten if it was going to affect no. my digestion. Uh, depending on how alkaline it is, but it's very unlikely. Sodium bicarbonate might affect your digestion because that's really, really alkaline. Right. But most waters aren't going to do that. Now, here's the thing, though. Acid... Acidity in the blood is a sign of toxicity. You don't want to think about it as being acidic as, you, as much as you want to think about it as toxicity. It means you're not processing poisons correctly. Okay? You, you with uh-huh. me, Mary? So that means a couple of things. Number one, your poisons are getting into your body, probably through the digestive system, either because you're eating the wrong food, 
foods or you're not digesting and processing them correctly or both. So I'd be focusing on foods and uh, digestive processing first and foremost. Okay. And then an- another thing, and this is very important when it comes to blood acidity and blood pH, etc. The main mechanism for keeping your blood alkaline and your blood needs to be slightly alkaline, the main mechanism is oxygen and respiration. That means blowing off carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide in the exhale uh, is acidic. In the exhalation is acidic. So the more you exhale, the more you're blowing off acid. You're exhaling acid. Did you know this, Mary? No, I did not. This is why you want to be making sure that you're respirating. Inhaling is alkaline. Oxygen is alkaline. So every time you take a a uh, 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 inhalation of oxygen, a breath of oxygen, you're raising your blood pH. And every time you exhale, you're blowing off acid. Again, you're raising your blood pH. So effective respiration is the main way we maintain blood pH, effective respiration. Now, if you have anything clogging the bread, you know what I mean when I say bread, Mm -hmm. the matrix, that's Mm -hmm. going to affect how uh, acid or alkaline the cells are at the cell level, and this is where the detoxification through the digestive system, uh, through eliminating the uh, problem foods and correcting digestive, uh, digestive processing come into play. You can also use things like bentonite clay and zeolite clay and algae that can connect up or chelate or magnetically attract toxins out of the body and that's another uh, strategy for you acidity means toxicity acid is toxic it's a sign it's it's a a condition of cellular waste cellular waste is acidic so if acids are building up it means cellular wastes are not being cleared gosh i hope i cleared things up for you a little bit for this last hour how simple the body is it really is not that complicated raisins and bread Cells get toxic, improve detoxification, oxygenation, make sure you're getting good nutrition, eliminating problem foods. It's really that simple. You know, and there's no do- no drugs required, no doctors required, no pharmacists required, no insurance companies required. We can do it all ourselves. And that's why this program, my friends, is called The Bright Side. It's the good news about the power of good nutrition. Thanks so much for listening, friends. We'll be back at you tomorrow with more good health information. Take care. We live in a complicated society. Stressful issues are always popping up. Have you ever been treated unfairly by someone? Have you ever been overcharged for a repair? Have you ever signed a contract or a document? Worried about identity theft? How many times have you been in those unique situations where you just wanted to call an attorney to find out if you're right or wrong or what your legal rights are? But every time you think about calling an attorney, what do you think about first? That's right. Who do you call and how much will it cost? Our friends at Legal Shield have found a solution. With a nationwide network of 6,900 attorneys who average over 19 years of experience, Legal Shield's law firms take over 40,000 calls per week helping their members. For less than $20 per month, you can have access to Legal Shield on everything from the trivial to the traumatic. Let Legal Shield stand up for your rights at lsprotection.com. That's lsprotection.com. Or call 855-340-SAVE, 855-340-7283. American gardeners and fellow patriots, make the right choice with your money, time, and your family food supply. Choose 100% pure heirloom seeds in the Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com. Why spend more? The Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com is only $37.95 and includes 20 varieties of pure, hardy, easy-to-grow heirloom seeds. Yes, only $37.95. That's 70% less than our competitors. You could buy three Survival Seed Vaults for less than one of theirs. The Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com includes detailed planting and seed saving instructions and ship same day. Plus, all orders over $49 ship free. MyPatriotSupply.com is American owned by patriots like you, passionate about freedom and preparedness. Call now, 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Or discover more emergency preparedness items when you order at MyPatriotSupply.com. Choose the original. Choose the Survival Seed Vault at MyPatriotSupply.com.